Four years and four days ago, we met on our first date. And although I've never said this to you before, I remember that moment knowing I was going to fall in love with you. Often, during ordinary times, I am suddenly struck by how well we fit together. I am excited and honored to be making this commitment and beginning this journey with you. When I find my way back home, I'll write you a poem, I'll sing you a song. When I find my way into your heart, we'll make a new start, we'll make a new start. When we make a new start. I was overjoyed with that. I was just happy for her because that's what we all want, is to have somebody that we can spend the rest of our life with and to have the kind of love that they have. That's what everybody wants. It was quite a travel event quite, for us. Yeah. <laughs> Seven or eight hundred miles. Yeah. Unfortunately, you have to go so far to a state that allows it, but nevertheless, it's definitely worth it. <laughs> they don't take it for granted, um, the love that they have for each Good other, point. and it's not just another day. It's very special. I was thrilled. I was thrilled that she found somebody that she loved and who loved her back. We love them. You know, they're perfect together. You know, just the, the look that In they give way. each other. It's amazing. When I find my place in this world, I'll be a new girl. I won't be afraid. When I find my voice within the chorus, I'll sing something for us. I'll sing something for us. And I won't sing off key. I won't feel sleepy. I won't sing anything that you can't appreciate. It'll only be the love that we made in that heart of yours when we made a new start. For Aaron and Jen, marriage is both a personal and political experience. Like many of us, this couple is painfully aware that although they now have the right to marry here in New Hampshire, couples in other states are still denied this right. Marriage is a vital social institution. The exclusive commitment of two individuals to each other nurtures love and mutual support. Marriage is at once a deeply personal commitment to another human being and a highly public celebration of the ideas of mutuality companionship, intimacy, fidelity, and family. Because it fulfills yearnings for security, safe haven, and connection that expresses our common humanity, the decision whether and whom to marry is among life's momentous acts of self-definition. It is undoubtedly for these reasons, as well as for its intimately personal significance, that civil marriage has long been termed a civil right. Without the right to marry, one is excluded from the full range of human experience. It was my 30th birthday, and we were sitting with my dad on a bench in Hood River. Dad, I don't know if you remember this, but you pointed out that my feet did not touch the ground. I looked down and noticed that my feet were resting on yours. Without thinking, I said, Jen is my ground. And that's when I knew you were the one for me. You are my ground, but you are also my sky. I give you with confidence the best version of myself I can offer as we begin our new journey together. When we find our hands in the night, won't that be a sight? But time is never wrong nor right. When we find our lives are better lived, We'll know this is it, we'll know this is it, and it won't be sappy, it won't be angry, it won't be anything that we don't believe in, it'll only be the love that we made in that heart of yours, then we made a new start. 
love that we made in that heart of yours when we met. I knew stars 